Hey guys, in this tutorial we're going to be covering sprite sheets and how to use a code to animate them. So the first thing we're going to do is create a quick plane. And then for our code, there's not really too much to go over here. It's pretty much the uh, X and Y of how many rows and columns you have. Uh, frames per second and then uh, everything else kind of gives a description of what it does so pretty much it'll go through each box for however many seconds until it switches to the next one and then once it gets to the end of um, one row or column it'll switch down to the next one and uh, go through until it gets to the end and go back through So what we're going to do here is I just went and downloaded a random sprite sheet. Oh, jeez. So here you can see um, they're just divided into boxes. I, I guess you can't really make out because they don't have lines, but um, there's certain tools out there that you can uh, create your own sprite sheets. You still have to go through and uh, make each image for it, but it'll lay it out for you just like this and such. So, um, yeah. Then, oh, I put it too low to the ground. <laughs> Alright, so the next thing we want to do is just throw our animated sprite script onto here. And you want to set this 4 and 4 there's four on the X and four on the Y. And then uh, frames per second. Um, hmm. Maybe we'll set that higher. So if you see, it's animated. And let's see, I don't know if I want to crank this up or bring it back down. But yeah, you can use these for uh, multiple different things. You can use these um, for particle effects and different stuff such as that to get really cool animated effects. If you're trying to make like a fog effect or something else where you want a little bit of animation, you can uh, use this technique.